Good morning. Welcome back to Exciting Science. I'm your host, Raju Manjia. We are still on the same day. And instead of talking about music as a mission, we are going to talk about love and laughter this morning. And the topic is Four Fridays for Love. And I have three ladies here to talk to me about love and laughter. Welcome to Exciting Science, ladies. Thank you, Raju. Thank you. <laughs> and these ladies are famous with me, of course. Michelle Washington, Sandra Torkis, and Nicole Monroe of Making Miracles. Quickly, they are here to talk about four plays that they are staging in the coming month of February. Stage is yours. <laughs> okay. Well, we have four plays, uh, four different venues for love each Friday in February, all for charity and fun. Uh, where can you go and get fruit meal and champagne? Canopy throughout the night. Where can you go and have some nice, intelligent conversation or flirtation abandon? I have no answer for that. I'm going to ask Sandra for an answer. Where, where can you go? Only Champagne. with MMQ. <laughs> Only MMQ. We are going into our seventh season, mm -hmm. and we're kicking it off with our theater salon series. And like Michelle says, we have um, four plays in four different venues, and this is theater in an intimate setting, mm -hmm. which we feel is novel in the Philippine world. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're very excited to kick off on Michelle, you think these girls can do that? <laughs> like kick off four plays? Oh, definitely. In a day, four in a month? <laughs> oh, for sure. Tell me how will they succeed. MMQ is fantastic at putting on amazing productions. Um, I'm in one of the four plays, and yes, we've uh. been rehearsing for weeks already. <laughs> so we are definitely prepared to put on a fantastic show every Friday for the month of February. How funny are these? From... Uh, from a ra uh, ranking of 1 to 10, from a scale of 1 to 10? 11 and a half. 11 and a half. And so uh, <laughs> can, I, can I get an example of one of the fun portions of these four plays? Well, they're four comedies, and they talk about love, the, whether it's love of job, love of women, love of men, love of stanukul, and you'll find out when you uh, come and see us what a stanukul <laughs> is, okay? Uh, love of job, as I said. Love of everybody. Love, love, love. What is the connection, Sandra, you're saying between love and laughter? Is there a relationship between love and laughter, if there is? It's very obvious. It's healthy. What is obvious, the laughter or the love? Both. You okay. must have to be balanced in your life. Now how, do, how does one go about it? You have to attend our productions, MMQ Theater. Uh, exactly. No, no, really, what is the real connection? Uh, Michelle, would you know? Yes. Your brain has a chemical called serotonin, and serotonin is released when you are in love. It makes your eyes go all googly. Serotonin yeah. is a chemical that's released from where? When you, your, your brain, brain releases that chemical yes. when oh, you are in love. when you laugh. And it also releases it when you laugh. So mm. being happy and laughing at one of our shows will definitely make you feel like you've fallen in love. Because MMQ ain't just like that. So would, would I be right in assuming that this is a class in chemistry rather than a <laughs> class in theater and acting? It's a class in charity. It oh. is a class in charity. We have some great charities this year. Side Gifts, again, we are going to help their women and children's uh, shelter in Martinica. And we also have the MMQ School. Remember, you're going with us this next time. MMQ we hike School the to, MM in to, 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 to learn what? Oh, or the kids. The, the kids. kids. I am going with you for sure, but I'm not uh, learning any acting taking up any acting. No, honey, you just have to come and love, love the I children. Would, I would love to be there. I would love to be there. Now, uh, how many people are acting in these four plays? Each um, is 10 minutes each? Yes. yes. And how many actors in that 10-minute uh, shindig? It depends on the show. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Four different plays each night. The show I'm in has four stars. Um, Michelle is also featured as an actress in one of the shows. Right. And yeah, her I might do a little something. It's something. only <laughs> two. Um, She's playing in two? You're in four of them. Oh, I'm in one with four actors. Okay. And there's another one that has two. Another one has, I think, five. Yeah, exactly. So it varies from play to play. Yeah, Any exactly. famous actors from the Philippines, oh from Hollywood, or from Broadway? Oh, easily. Anybody we know? Anybody uh, my viewers know? Mm -hmm. Possibly. Issa Lippin is a celebrity. Issa Lippin, Filipina. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 
and Nick Campos from uh, the Terry Emanuel. Mm-hmm. Nick Campos, he played uh, the elephant in Seussical. Oh, okay, that was easy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. And of course, Michelle Monroe. Let's not I forget know. Michelle <laughs> Monroe. <laughs> right, okay. Right. So what will happen? So you go to, co- what are these things, by the way? Home, theater? Uh they are in people's homes, just like with the French salons of the 1800s, where people would go and drink champagne and go from room to room and experience laughter and love and full and short plays. All guaranteed. Laughter first, love to follow. Mm, yeah, mm-hmm. I, I would say that's uh, safe to say. What does it take for me to attend one or all of them? What's the deal? What's the business side of your transit? We're selling tickets for each show. And um, am I allowed to say how much it costs? Yeah, I don't know. It's up to you. Do okay. You on the house? So for 2,000 pesos per performance, you get the free flow on the champagne. You get the wonderful mate. You get to be amongst beautiful people. And then you will experience our uh, theater ticket production. All for charity. And then that's our way of giving back to the industry and so everybody will have a great time. So if you would like to attend all four shows, we can work that out too. But basically it's the same performance each time in a different venue. And it's a home venue setting, whether it's inside the house or in the garden. Sometimes it will move from one location to the other, depending on... Things that, that you see yes. in both. This is going to be a tough call to make a home turn into a theater. Not really. Not really? Not, not here. big stage? Not, not here. here in the Philippines? No. Everything is possible in the Philippines. Absolutely. How many total number of actors and uh, people behind the uh, curtains, people behind the stage? Oh, how many people that's involved? Double then. <laughs> <laughs> About 26 people. And how many together. days of uh, blood and sweat and fun have you put into this? Four Fridays for Love. Oh, when have we not? We started <laughs> our <laughs> auditions in December, and yeah. then we started our rehearsals in January. So yeah, we've right. done it. Any new faces? Well, let's see. There's Dylan. Uh, Dylan's Stella. a new face? Yeah. yeah, he's the Dylan of Solana. Wait until you see him. Oh, my gosh. He's just going to take your breath away. He's so funny. He is so funny. Uh, well, Annika, Issa. <laughs> he, he's just fun. He's wonderful. All right. So, okay. So uh, now tell me the last famous words for love and laughter. Why is it important that uh, MMC does this? I don't ask a why question, but why love and laughter? And give me something that will help me become more loving and more laughing soul. Funny for the coming day. How do I make the most out of Valentine's? Let's say that. Ooh. Valentine's is one of my favorite holidays because it's all about love. And you give love by giving to charity, by donating and helping improve the lives of women and children here in the Philippines. That's one aspect of it. Sandra? And February is Love Month. We have to celebrate the whole month long. Hence the theme. Hence the month. Mm-hmm. And uh, we just want to focus on the love piece. We have to give back. What are the chances mm-hmm. of people coming in, couples coming in, guys and girls coming in, and going out more loving and more happy from these four shows? What are the chances, and how do you assure that? How does MMC make sure that people who come in become a lot more funnier <laughs> and a lot more happier as they step out? Oh, my God. Well, the champagne always helps. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, right, right. Okay, okay. <laughs> the champagne. But the, the total vibe, the ambiance is all very mm-hmm. warm and fuzzy. Yeah, and sounds like uh, a party. Flirtation yeah. is a big factor. Exactly. So right. uh, um, conversation. We obviously try to attract uh, charming people like yourself. Okay, okay. That means I'm invited. Yes. And also I'm charming. Wow, that's exactly. good. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> of course. But it also uh, is multicultural, cross-cultural. We have people from every walk of life come to our shows. And it's always interesting to see your audience mixed up. Exactly. It just uh, adds a little spice and spark. And uh Also, it's interactive. Yes. Oh, a little, little bit of improv in it. Yeah, I bit, definitely want to attend bit. two of them then. Okay. I want to attend the one on February 1 and February 22 with Mr. Cruz over here. 
Is that cool. okay? Because I have picked up a few lessons by the time I come to Alabama. This is good. So thank you very much for being on this show, and I hope you get mileage with this little interaction with me. But is there anything else that I should have asked you about this show and I didn't ask you? Website, phone number? Oh, yes. Please give us a call at 0927-383-9517. Let that me repeat that. Let me, uh, would you repeat that? 0927? 0927-383-9517. And oh. mmqtheater.com. And the dates. It's every Friday night, February 1, February 8, February 15, and February 22nd. At a different venue each evening. And the website, Michelle? mmqtheater.com. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Mm -hmm. All right. And so Facebook. We're also and on Facebook, Facebook and Twitter. Mm -hmm. Okay. So thank you very much for being on Expat Insights, and thank you very much for putting up four Fridays for love. Oh, thank and you, And I love Roger. laughter. I love love. Hey. Good thing. And I wish you also the very best for Lake Cabaret, which is coming up in it is. It November. Coming November. November. 14. And you have some other events in between those two. Yes, we do. The children's workshop, the purple party, which I hope you can come and dress in and purple. And the Bataan School that I'm going to. Yes. God bless. Good luck. And keep on laughing and keep on loving. Thank you. Roger. And keep on acting and keep on making miracles. Thank Absolutely. you very much. Michelle, I hope Absolutely, you enjoyed this. Absolutely, right? This is your first time. Absolutely. Time. So God bless. Thank you very much. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen, the ladies from MMQ. So see them in February for four Fridays for love. And Michelle, Sandro, and Michelle one more time. So good night and Mabu hai. Have a great weekend ahead of you. I'm your host, Raju Mandian. Next week on Expat Insights, we have two guests, Thomas Nang from Australia, and hopefully a lady called Anita Murjani. And they will talk about stuff that I've never, ever discussed on this show. Good night and Mabu hai.